Well hello, you're joining us at the Rocks Estate today, the North Country Center for the Forest Society up in beautiful Bethlehem, New Hampshire. And the Rocks Estate, as you can see, is listed on the National Register of Historic Places. Well, here at the Rocks, we've started to melt. It was minus 12 last week and now it's 40. You can hear all the snow and the ice dripping, melting away. If you look over at that big tree ahead of us, you can look up way into the top of the branches and you can see opposite branching. This means that for us up here, it's either an ash tree or a maple tree. And when we look at the bark of that one, we know that it's an ash tree. But we'll take a look at some rock maple and some red maple to see the difference. Well, let's take a look at a couple of trees right here. This is a big sugar maple. And if we look up, you can see that there's opposite branching. And as you look at the buds, you can hardly see them from down here. That's because they're sharp, small, and pointy. But if you look way over at the next tree that Jesse's panning to, you can see that we've got opposite branching up there, but you can see big, round, red buds, and that's a red maple tree. And if you'd like to learn more about tree ID and how to tap trees, Come up to our programs in March and help us tap a tree and watch maple syrup being made. Well, here we are standing in front of some of our sugar maple trees. And if you can't wait for this year, you could go out and buy some maple syrup from last year. It's still good. Go on to our website, NewHampshireMapleExperience.com and grab some recipes and start making your maple recipes now. Well, thank you for watching the latest video that we've put out between Jesse and I so that you can keep up with what's happening at the Rocks Estate. And please keep an eye out to see our next video when we put it online.